Hello students, welcome back. This is your teacher Ms. Siona Gonzalez from Adarsh Education Society. Today in this video, we are going to continue with maths. So students, we have already learned to compare objects on basis of their sizes, weights, lengths and heights. When we see two balls, we can easily say that one ball is big and the other one is small. So now let's learn to compare objects on their quantity. When we have two objects of different quantities, one is more and the other one is less. Now let us look at these two boxes of chocolates. Now students tell me, are the number of chocolates in both the box same? No, right? Yes, so the number of chocolates in the left box are more and the number of chocolate in right box are less. In the same way, in this picture, the number of cookies in left dish that is the red dish are more and the number of cookies in the right dish that is the blue dish are less. Here the water in the left jar is more and the water in the right jar is less. Here in this picture there are some birds sitting on the branches of trees. So students we can easily see that the birds on the left branch are more and the birds on the right branch are less. Now let us do some evaluation. On the screen you can see two pictures. We have to write L below the picture with less objects and M below the picture with more objects. So let us count. How many boats are there in the left picture? Yes, there are three boats in the left picture and six boats in the right picture. So what are we going to write? Yes, we are going to write L below the left picture and M below the right picture. Now let's move on to the next picture. Here we can see that there are six birds in the left picture and three birds in the right picture. So we are going to write M below the left picture and L below the right picture. In this picture we can see that there are five children in the left picture and two children in the right picture. So we are going to write yes. M below the left picture and L below the right picture. Now in the next example we have to circle the picture with less objects. So here we can see that in the left picture there are only two hats and in the right picture there are how many? Yes, four hats. So we are going to circle the left side. In this picture we can see that on the left hand side there are five strawberries and on the right hand side there are three strawberries. So we are going to circle the right side. In this picture there is only one brush on the left side and there are four brushes on the right side. So what side are we going to circle? Yes, we are going to circle the left side. Now in the next few examples, we have to circle the picture with more objects. In this picture, we can see that on the left picture, there are 8 butterflies. And on the right picture, how many butterflies? Yes, there are 7 butterflies. So 8 is more than 7. So we are going to circle, yes, the left side. Here, there are six spiders on the left side and how many spiders are there on the right side? Yes, there are nine spiders. So, we are going to circle the right side. Yes, very good. In the next examples, we have to tick the box with less objects and cross the box with more objects. Here, on the left side, there are five brinjals and on the right side there are two brinjals. So where are we going to put a tick mark? Yes, we are going to put a tick mark on the right side below the two brinjals and we are going to cross on the left side below the five brinjals. Here on the left side we see burgers and on the right side we see 
ice creams so now let us count the burgers how many burgers are there correct there are nine burgers and how many ice creams are there come on count yes there are 10 ice creams so what is less burgers or ice creams correct burgers are less so we are going to put a tick mark besides the burger and we are going to put a cross mark besides the ice creams very good now next here we can see there are kittens now count how many kittens are there on the left side correct there are 10 kittens on the left side and there are three kittens on the right side so where are we going to put a tick mark yes we are going to put a tick mark below the three kittens on the right side and we are going to put a cross mark on the left side below the 10 kittens yes very good students so that's it for today i will meet you in the next video until then take care stay home stay safe bye bye